I just have the, the elder power. Fine. Ooh. And that hit pretty good for him. Been using a uh, using the knife for so long. I'm not sure I even realized if it was good or not. Just being decent, so using it. Mace so far. That was pretty good. Let's see how it does against everything else. Actually, let me go rest. My health is so low. I want to go in there with low health. Of course. Of course you're out of wood. Why wouldn't you be? He's still there? This thing, things just don't don't despawn in this game. Not that you know, I'm complaining, but I'm just you know you're used to playing games all the time with everything that spawns and disappears. And I play this and like shit will sit there. I'll log out, play for 20 hours, come back and shit's still sitting there. <laughs> with pieces of wood in the middle of a forest, I forgot I even went to. What triggers rested status? Is, would that just to be sleeping? Oh no, I just went back up. We had to be standing. Standing by the fire. Oh, wrong one. I keep doing that. And the fun continues. Where were we? Right here? I really don't remember. We oh, yeah, have fancy stairs. I think there's nothing up there. Yeah, I think we're in here. That's right. I broke my chest. This one looks like it's a, a dead end. Two dead ends. I have a third. This is fine. Bunch of free scrap. No monsters to deal with. Still think I have plenty of um crypt to explore. Can't get it. Okay. 
All right, let's move on to the next section. We go here. Looks empty. Anyway, they don't give you much crap. All this, and I've only got eight. Hello. I mean, that's not bad considering I don't have it the skill level of 20, so I have no damage bonus with this thing. And it's still, it's still hitting pretty hard. His pick is, his pick is about to break. Yep, there it goes. Alright, let's run out to our little shack. Not shack, but it's um... Tiny, mighty tower. There. Oh, here, let's, let's do this. run back to base camp and offload some of this stuff. I grab those blood bags. I think they the healing. Thought I saw it. I thought. Ugh, I thought I saw a leech there. Let's go and grab our other pickaxe real quick. I need them. I need that for poison resistance, I think. I think it was what? Necks, thistles, and these things? 
Dandelions? Oh no, not dandelions. I do need necks and thistles. Oh, the healing potions need dandelions. Right. And honey. I should probably collect these honey. I have a ton of honey, so I just haven't been grabbing it. Hey, what's up, Jay? Welcome to the lurk mode. Head back over. I guess since you're a moderator, you don't count as a as a viewer. <laughs> I didn't see it two viewers on there, and then you, you popped up out of nowhere. I think this is where we left off. We'll continue. So in the um on the console during the day when I fuck with the kids, I, I've been playing uh, Arcade Paradise. It's on uh, Game Pass right now. For, not for free. I, I hate saying it's free. I pay for Game Pass. So it's not free, but um, yeah, Arcade Paradise. It's on game. It's pretty fun. It's a pretty interesting little game. And to be honest, like the previews, it, it doesn't really explain the game well or explain what it is. So if you, if you hadn't seen it, basically, you your dad gives you this laundry mat um, to run as your own like, little business because he's like a wealthy businessman and he wants you to have a responsibility. Uh, so he gives you this laundry mat, and what you end up doing is like behind his back, uh, turning it and slowly turning it into an arcade, and like the back rooms are you turn like put a bunch of arcade machines and stuff. And then, like, you're still working the laundromat, earning money, like, wash people's clothes and stuff and picking up trash. But you're also, you know, getting money from the arcade in the back. And then you're slowly converting the whole laundromat over into a whole arcade. And, and then, you know, of course, in the arcade, all the games are legit games you play. And, you know, they all have stats and, um, 
you know, playability. It's it's really really interesting, cool concept for a little game. Uh, really enjoying it. A lot of like retro, old school arcade games. You know, a lot of you older folks might have played your kids. So I definitely I recommend trying it out if you like that kind of stuff, like business management type of game. But yeah, I've been I've been having a, having a blast with it. I I kind of. I got I, I got the laundromat half converted and, and then put it put the game down for a bit to play play something else I forget what but I just picked it back up the last couple of days. Now I'm I'm down to like three washing machines. That's all that's left there. <laughs> yeah, it has no idea. I'm curious to see. I I, I assume you uh, eventually convert the whole thing into. An arcade, and it's no longer modern at all. I I do. <clears throat> I kind of like these like business management type games. Another one's uh, I think what's called Moonlighter, where you like you, you go into like a little dungeon, <clears throat> but I. At night, you go in the dungeon. And during the day, you run a little store where you sell all the crap you found in the dungeon, and like you set the prices and all that kind of stuff. Like that one's really cool. Little just run your own business kind of a kind of games are really fun to me. There's one I, I I've considered trying. I think it's like Shop Titan or something like that. Thinking about giving that one a shot since I, I like the, these other two. That one seems like it might be kind of up my alley. Oh, dead end. How are we looking? I'm getting pretty full. Hello. That was crazy. I still have not found the ruin that shows me where Bowmass is at. And please, if if you if you see my videos and in you saw that I passed it and I didn't see it, let me know. <laughs> and I'll go back and find it. Let me do a quick r run back through in case I missed it here. It's just a little red, like, ruin tablet thing. This is my second one. I, I feel like I would have seen it by now. Unless they're rare, and I don't. Oh, not back here. All right, we'll press on. Hard to get. I just can't get get up there in the cracks.
Alright, I think that's it for that one. <clears throat> Did I go? No, okay. I must have at least got the chest. Get this then. <clears throat> 